Hello guys, welcome to Mechanical Design Maker. In this video, we are going to learn about what is GDNT, uses of GDNT and its symbols and standards. Now let's get into the video. GDNT is an international language used on engineering drawing to accurately describe a part. Basically, GDNT is a way for communicating engineering tolerances through symbols. For example, a drawing drawn by Chinese design engineer could be able to read by Indian design engineer. GDNT is a precise that could be used to describe the size, form, orientation and location of a part. And it is a design philosophy about functional dimensioning. It is very important. GDNT allows a part to fit at and function at assembly level. Uses of GDNT GDNT reducing drawing changes so that engineering change management can be minimized and we can get increased productivity and design clarity. Mainly GDNT reducing inspection failure rate. So, the rejection of part reduced, it gives major impact on cost. GDNT symbols There is five types of GDNT symbols that is form, profile, orientation, location and runout. The big four is form, orientation, location and runout because the profile without datum also controls the form tolerance. Here, the concentricity and symmetry removed by ASME Y14.5 2018 since these both can be controlled by position tolerance itself. We will see the detailed explanation of each symbol in later videos. GDNT International Standard North America uses their own standard ASME Y14.5 created by American Society of Mechanical Engineers and ISO GPS standards. Majorly, this standard is used in the multinational company. Here the list of ISO GPS substandard for individual specification. My video will cover both ASME and ISO GPS standards. Here 150 ISO standards published under the direct responsibility of ISO Technical Committee 2 and 3. When we talk about ISO GPS standard, ISO 1101 is widely used in European and Asia Pacific countries. This standard is mainly used to define all the geometrical tolerance, form, orientation, location and runout. I just keep this as an example. This standard as translated to GBT, the Chinese standard, which is equivalent to ISO GPS. The same scene for Indian standard and also for Japan, France, Germany, UK. They are all using ISO GPS. There are numerous substandard for ISO GPS. Look at the drawing here. If you want to understand the size tolerance that is diameter, you need to find definition about size from ISO 14405-1. If you want to understand position tolerance, you need to check from ISO 1101 and for some pattern position, you need to check from ISO 5458. If you want to find out maximum material modifier, you need to check from ISO 2692. If you want to find out what is datum, you need to check from ISO 5459. All of the definition regarding geometric tolerance you can find from one standard ASME Y14.5 2018 followed by 14.5.1 2019. As I said earlier, concentricity and symmetry tolerance removed from ASME Y14.5. Other than this, when comparing, most definitions are same between ASME standard and ISO GPS standard, but there are 15 to 20 percent differences. 
This is the official website. Here you can find the further information about ASME Y14.5 standards and ISO GPS standards. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos.